Good evening and thanks for joining us. Three people have been arrested in connection to the death of a Terre Haute man. They're all facing murder charges tonight. Police arrested Shane Johnson, Logan Morris, and Jeffrey William Recopito. Officers say they killed Dwayne French. According to police, French died Wednesday from serious brain injuries. At 5 o'clock, you heard from his family. Now, News 10's Richard Solomon shares a heartbreaking message from his mother. Richard was with the family earlier today. Right here is where neighbors say they found Dwayne French bleeding out. You can still see his blood staining the concrete. I spoke with his family earlier. They say this was completely unexpected and unnecessary. What are some of the emotions that you all are feeling standing in this spot right now? Anger. Lots of anger. Yep. Jay Presnell says he's filled with shock as he and his family prepare to bury his brother, Dwayne French. He had so much to live for. It wasn't supposed to be this way. In the early morning hours of August 21st, French was getting ready to head to work. That's when he was beaten and robbed by three people. He was taken to a hospital in Indianapolis where he was in a coma for 11 days. His mother, Sandra French, says she was only able to see him once before he died. It was terrible. He was unresponsive there too because his whole back of his head was split open. That's why he had so much brain damage. Terre Haute Police Sergeant Ryan Adamson says these three, Shane Johnson, Logan Morris, and Jeffrey William Recupido are now facing murder charges. We can never take it back. We can never bring uh, Mr. French back. But hopefully this helps um, and gives peace and closure to the victim's family. The family says there's no amount of justice that could bring their Frenchie back. I'm missing my best friend and my riding buddy. I'm missing my loving son. The family says they're preparing a motorcycle ride in honor of French. They want everyone to know just how loved he was by the entire community. Reporting in Terre Haute, I'm Richard Solomon, News 10.